Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a quick unboxing and I guess I want to take the time here to kind of process how I want my 2024 planning, mostly planning, um, work-related stuff will be. And I've had this realization over the past couple of weeks that I have to accept it. The cousin is not going to work out for me, mainly because of the kind of work that I'm currently doing. So while last year and the earlier part of this year has been manageable, you can really see the struggle um, in my videos that I was shifting from an A6 to a cousin and then along the way I had to get a totally separate notebook just for work-related items. So... For myself, maybe you have the same struggle as me and as much as I would like to incorporate Hobonichi into my professional planning and yeah, going about my workday, it has really not been the best setup for me um, to a point that I was so stressed about using my cousin and at a point wherein I was just dreading using the cousin and it shouldn't be that way the the hobonichi and planning in general should be a tool for you something to help you cope with a very busy and hectic um, work and life and your hobbies and all of that so i've decided okay i'm gonna go back to basics i'm gonna do it the way it was before mm -hmm. i even knew of Hobonichi. So I purchased something from Shopee and I was meaning to share this with you earlier but unfortunately I accidentally had it shipped to my parents house so I wasn't able to get to it immediately. But anyway it's now here and that's what I will be unboxing with you guys today. And here I am going down to basics. <laughs> if you're new here, hi, my name is Karen. I'm a lefty who loves fountain pens, writing, journaling, planning, hobonichi, and all of that good stuff. So if you like those kinds of content, hope you can consider subscribing and join my small community. Anyway, so what I got here is this thing. Let me just open it up. Okay, to spare you of the very annoying um, crinkling of plastic, I got myself a binder. So yeah, I'm. I realized that with the type of work that I'm doing, I'm juggling not just between two projects or two initiatives, but I'm really handling a lot of things at the same time. Although. Granted, I'm able to schedule it in such a way that makes it a bit bearable. There have been some, you know, there's always that switching, shifting from one project to another. My day is just a jumble of different meetings with different stakeholders. And I realized that a straight-up linear notebook like the Hobonichi or a cousin, or a day free, will really, really confuse all of my notes. So I decided to just go back to basics. This is what I did in college, and I got myself a binder. A binder with partitions. So I plan to just label the projects that I have, and then just put it here. And then I got myself some loose leaf pages. So what I do is notes for a specific project i write it here and then i place it and organize it here in my binder and for me i think that's the simplest way to address a problem that i've been having the past couple of months so thinking about 
how my 2024 will be for next year, I haven't really finalized it yet. I may need to do a mind mapping of sorts, a, a, a bit of reflection. But anyway, I just wanted to come out here and share with you guys what I have finally <laughs> decided. And yeah, I'm going to my meeting now. Bye, guys!